it's time for some Las Cola. That's Spanish for the colas. Hey everyone, welcome back to Obscure Cola. Coming to you from the inside of my Honda Stepwagon rental van. I'm about to go to Kansai Airport to fly back to Hong Kong. I got a couple drinks I want to do. Some quick reviews, and this is the quietest place I could find. I'm actually in the parking lot of a Lawson's uh, at a gas station. I just filled up my rental car, if you care. You don't. Um, anyway, so today we have a generic Japanese cola. This one is called Las Cola. And uh, you may recall, I'm sure you haven't because only 10 people watch it, but I did one a long, long, long time ago when I first started the channel called LA Cola, which was also from Japan, but I found it on sale in Hong Kong. And uh, it was not very good. Uh, I think it had artificial sweetener, if I remember correctly. Uh, this one is not the same. It is Las Cola, as in, I don't know, Las Vegas. But in fact, it's uh, it's an abbreviation. And LAS stands for Los Angeles Sunshine. And it says in Japanese, Las Cola. Or it says in English, Las, and then Koda in Japanese. So I don't know what the heck this thing is. It's a different one. Or the same. Maybe they decided to change from LA to LAS or what. Or it's a different company and they tried to call it LA Cola and they found out someone else already made it LA Cola. So they said, screw you, we're going to make it LAS Cola. But long story short, I mean, can you screw up a generic cola as long as you got real sugar? Probably should be fine. So let's give it a try. Smells like whatever. Select soda. So right before I filmed this video, I actually did this guy, which was Met's Black Cola. So I've just finished a cola. I actually didn't even finish. I just drank half a cola, and now I'm drinking a different one, and I have to make sure that I differentiate the flavors in my mouth. Although I do notice that this one definitely tastes different than that one. This one has kind of a artificial taste on top. I'm trying to have, like... Besides the caramel coloring and flavoring, I'm tasting something else. And it's not good. And it doesn't taste like LA and it doesn't taste like sunshine. So I have to take that back. Maybe you can screw up generic cola. Because this one, somehow, the mix isn't quite right. It tastes, even though it actually, uh, you know, I double checked, it's got sugar, it doesn't have any artificial sweeteners. But somehow it doesn't taste right. It tastes chemically, even though it's not. Shouldn't. So yeah, I don't like. I know what it reminds me of. Back when I would get select sodas. This is way back, you know, twenty something years ago when I was living in the Bay Area back in, back in the day. We would buy so much, either select soda or, the generic Costco ones, the Kirkland ones, or whatever like that if you left them for like a long time because we would buy them by the you know by the pallet and maybe if it was like a year old it would taste like the cola had separated from the water and stuff like that that's what this reminds me of okay that's really random but that's pretty much what it is okay so yeah i don't know where that came from but that's what it reminds me of uh, Sugar-wise, this one is listed in carbs, is listed as 11 grams of carbs per 100 milliliters, as they do in Japan. They don't break down the sugar separately, but that's actually pretty close. The uh, Mets Cola was exactly the same, and a Coke in Japan is 11.3, so this one is pretty much the same. Okay, so I have to give a final verdict on the Las Cola, generic cola from Japan. I don't know what to say, except... Las Cola, I hope you stick it where the Los Angeles sun don't shine. Okay, does that make sense? I'm insulting them. Okay, so that was pretty stupid, of course, as always. Uh, but that's it for today. See you guys next time. Bye. Everyone, welcome back to Obscure Cola. Today we're going to try Coca-Cola Apple. I'm here with my son in Japan. Just got this at a family mart today. Apparently, Coca-Cola...